Ah, good. Lighting looks good. Let me see that. Let me see that, that box real quick. What is going on, everybody? I don't know if I have the mic on. Mic is on. Mic is good. We are doing this today. You guys like these, don't you? So today we're gonna be fishing out with some uh, with some baits at the M2B box. You know, this this box is uh, I use this once a month for you guys. Do a little bit of a challenge. I almost dropped this in the water. That would have been really bad. But we're gonna be fishing this on a lake today that I don't really know fairly well. But we're gonna knock this thing out. If you guys want to order one of these, you guys can save ten dollars right now. Use code Lunkers. It's down below. Click on the link. Type in the code. Save ten bucks off your box. Why wouldn't you want to save ten bucks? I don't know. You're crazy if you don't. Let's check out what we got going on this month. We got spinnerbait. We'll be able to slow roll this by some docks for sure. For sure. The salty lizard. This will work here. It's got a green pumpkin. I think they like really natural colors here. Is what I've been told. This. Oh, got a little little topwater action going on. Don't know if this is gonna work here on Chickamauga if I was in Texas, for sure. On a little pond, that'd, that'd do fairly well. What else we got, what else we got? Jerk bait, jerk bait. Don't know if I'll be fishing this for spawning fish. I think they're, they're pretty much, we're gonna be flipping. This'll work, this'll be throwing on a shaky head. I do like this color. It's a good, good little color, I don't even know what color this is. I don't know, yellow green, that's what we're gonna call it. Yellow green color. And then last but not least, a little ema, a little square bell. This'll probably work around the docks as well. The only thing that I don't think I'll be throwing today is probably this little top water because it's not that time of, uh, not that time here in, in old, old Chickamauga. You gotta get that bait right in their face to get them to eat. So we're gonna do that, we're gonna knock that out. But do us a favor, use that code LUNKERS. Save that 10 bucks off that box, it's down below. Now let's go see if we can catch some fish. Oh, those are those high quality glasses right there, aren't they? Let me see those. Oh no, there's, those are high quality glasses. You wanna show people how, what they look like? Oh, hey, hey everybody. We got the uh, new uh, collapsible Costas, not yet released. Just fold them up, stick them in your pocket, pull them out, put them on. They sit crooked on your face, you're good to go. Everybody kept asking me, Rob, what sunglasses do you wear? Well, I put those on yesterday. They're real quality. Something like that, so you look, don't move your right arm. So I'll just have you do the motion with me. Ah, first fish. Wow, wow. Ah, got him in the back. That lure's out of the way. <laughs> Here we go. Ah, come on, stop, 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 stop. First fish on that shaky head. I don't even, still to this day, don't know what color is. We're called green pumpkin yellow. Yep. Green pumpkin yellow, MTB. This fish wanted it. Good to go. Alright, that was good. First fish to the boat. <laughs> Alright, so what do I what do I need to do here? I need to switch over. Oh god! So we need to switch over to something else out of this box. What do you think? What do you guys think? He's Cabin Creek 6 inch salty lizard. Give this thing a shot. Throwing a lizard. Actually, you know what? I'm not gonna throw this lizard on a shaky head. You know what I'm gonna throw it on? We're gonna do this. Just work on getting momentum. We're gonna put this lizard on the flipping hook. There you go. Yeah. yeah like that. that might work. That might. This might work. What do you think? Flip it into a tree? Yeah. They might eat it. They might eat this thing. Yep. See there you go. <laughs> Look how big that gar is. Dude, there's there. one, two, three, four. Dude, there's like 50, 50 gar right there. Those are all gar. See? Yeah. Go, yeah, go <sighs> I was sitting here counting gar and caught a fish. Bass number two on the MTB lures. What is this one, the Cabin Creek? This is the uh, little lizard. All right guys, let's make a big adjustment. No, I'm serious, let's get up from, let's go to, yeah, we're gonna move pretty far. See, this is the kind of shit we were, this is, the, this is, this is what we were kind of fishing the other day. Yeah, I think it's gonna be good. I just wanted to fish this tree. It's got some lay downs, it's a steep bank. It's got some stuff in the water. It might be pretty good. The water clarity is about, 200 times different than when we were just fishing. This is like somewhat clear and not poop brown. In the tree. Oh, it's a good one. That's a good fish, there we go. That's a good one, boys. Oh, there we go. 
Look at that in the tree. Ooh, wow. Whew. Stuck them. The there we go. That's a good fish, man. That's a good one. That's a good solid quality fish. He was in that bush. In that bush. One quick adjustment. Getting me excited out there. What do you think? Three and a half? Salt three and a half? Oof. All right, let's get her back in the water. Good. Good, I like this, dude. We changed that water clarity, came right to this. Sweet. First good fish of the day. Your camera. What? Wait, oh, wait, shit. mine? It was his camera. Wait, where's mine? Oh shit! <laughs> that was that literally, was that really my camera? <laughs> we just hit a fing wave to bounce some shit off the boat. Mmm. Let's just say I think it was a catamaran, maybe, or something of that nature. Yeah. I wasn't expecting the wave to be that bad. Went in, hit the first wave. We didn't have anything strapped down because I mean it's there's only two mile hour winds, we weren't expecting any waves. And uh Scott's three thousand was about three thousand dollars for that camera setup. About that, yeah. About three thousand dollars when bouncing off the boat into the bottom of the lake. Thank God I brought an extra camera because I'm just going to give him that camera to use because it's it's one hundred and ten percent my fault. That just cost me three thousand dollars right there. But he's fishing in tournaments. So we haven't told him yet, so uh, you guys get to see his reaction. I don't think he's going to believe me that I lost his camera. Gonna film his reaction. I'm going to film his reaction. I'm actually going to film us telling him that we just lost this three thousand dollars. He's going to think it's a prank because I have the camera, but it's. 110% not a prank. Oh, this day of fishing has gone. <laughs> what was that? Chickamauga sucks. These fish in this state are so much more timid than Texas. Yeah. See it? <laughs> yeah, kinda. Oh, yeah, I see it. Man. See it? Yeah. <laughs> Dude, don't pitch over there. <laughs> don't you, just, ca really don't just cast in the middle of the lake. <laughs> no, you're good. No, you should be plenty good. I don't know. <laughs> He's just new to this pitching thing. Okay, so Scott's back. We're back at the ramp. The last time you guys talked to me, I was over there trying to catch a bedded fish, and it was complete. It's just, just a bad day, and we're about to go find out if he did good or not. He doesn't know yet that his camera is sitting in 30 foot of water. All right, well, uh, so, how'd it go? Does he, does, he, does he know yet? He doesn't know? No, I was like so nervous. I, I was so nervous he was gonna ask about like, filming or something with cameras. He didn't bring anything up. So did, I, just, did, did I kept win? like changing. No, he lost. Uh oh. Oh, here he comes. Oh, All right, I gotta get out. Okay. All right, you can have your shitty glasses bag. I don't want that. Right. Make, make sure you guys go buy some Costas. <laughs> um, well, What up? Oh. What's the issue? Yeah, it's a little bit of an issue. What? I would say it's uh, so we were cruising. Yeah. There was like a little catamaran with a. Let's just say that the wake went boom, 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 and yeah. there was a camera that went dugoog, dugoog. Really? Nah. So I'm gonna give you mine. It was my fault. Really? <laughs> I'm not kidding. The camera's going. <laughs> yeah. You showed the trick like I did on Brandon wherever I made him check it last year. I, 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 I knew. I was like, geez, I'm going to believe us. No, I'm indeed 100% dead serious. Camera's in the water in 31 foot of water. Where was the camera sitting? <laughs> it was in the console. It was right. His bag was in front of that. It was like sailor stand. And then he hit some bumps. His and, bag went and he flying. went. He, oh, he yeah. hit him pretty hard. And yeah, my bag went out in the water, and I dove out and caught it. Like we were lucky that the rods didn't even go into the water. It, it literally came out of nowhere. Like, he didn't even hit it going that fast. Yeah, 
I'm only going like 72. Huh? No, I'm only doing about 40. I want to watch the GoPro footage of it though. All of a sudden, I, his, he hit one, and I see his bag get there, and I go, yo, 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 and boom, bag goes, camera goes, and he goes, and like grabs it by the handle, his bag in the water, has his laptop, yeah, all the camera gear, everything. I had like six, so that's when he's giving you. This mic might be as much as that other camera anyway, but here we go. Dude, you don't have to do that. It's real easy. Just turn it on. Well, Scott took that just about as, as well as anyone could, and I knew he wasn't going to be in that bad of a mood. I gave him my other camera. That's like my backup camera just in case I drop this one inside the water or it gets messed up. So I'm just going to give him that. It works. It's uh, about the same or a little bit more, but it's fine. It's not that big of a deal. Cleared it up. He's okay. Uh, he actually ended up didn't do very well today. He had three keepers in total. Uh, the other guy had five. Apparently, they dropped the water and... It just doesn't fish as well. It fished really bad for everybody, apparently. It's not a big deal. You know why? Because we got a couple fish on this box on a really tough day of fishing. So that should tell you guys something. Go use the code Lunkers. I don't get, I don't make any money off that code, by the way. It's all for you guys. Save 10 bucks on your first box. Use code Lunkers. I will see you guys tomorrow with another bass fishing episode. Hit the link below. Type it in. L-U-N-K-E-R-S. I love you guys. I'll see you tomorrow. Should I do the big old washa in the middle of this parking lot? Washa! All the pros are looking at me weird.